Bully is a cult classic game with a loyal fan base that stems back 15 years. The game's biggest strengths are the compelling characters, hilariously dark humour and varied missions. You could say these strengths are what keep us coming back to Bullworth time and time again. However, much of what Bully did well was somewhat underdeveloped, almost like it never left the experimental stage. And to be honest, it's hard to be optimistic that Mega Corporation and Rockstar would do the right thing and give their team the leverage to set realistic expectations, research and collect your feedback. So let's throw some ideas out there in the comments section and see what sticks. I'm Claymer, and these are my top 5 features I'd like to see in Bully 2. Number 1. We all love Jimmy Hopkins, Pete, Sheldon and Algie. However, I believe, and it's just my opinion, we need a new protagonist. Our generation thrives wow. off nostalgia. It's not a good thing. Companies use this weakness to manipulate us into settling for mediocrity. I'm open to change. There's no harm in new characters to offer new experiences. What? With no backstory limitations. With that being said, a continuation of Jimmy's story in the form of an expansion pack would satisfy both old and new fans of the series. If I'm wrong, let me know in the comments. Number 2. A highly detailed small town. It's the small details that create special moments, and a small map ensures designers can refine the aspects often overlooked in lifeless open world designs. Give us access to every building in the game. This type of modelling in 2021 should never be accepted. Let's have fully fleshed out interiors we can interact with and explore. Give us access to the homes of friends and families. If I explore abandoned buildings or the woods, give me the option to claim and customise mysterious serious plots of land for my own. If I catch the school bus, who's on that bus? Are there bullies or rival schools I need to avoid? Make school travel a challenge in itself. Number 3. Survival mechanics and character development. You never got the sense that Rockstar prioritised character movement and fighting mechanics. We don't have shooting to fall back on to keep the game exciting. I like to see a variety of intricate movements and actions our player can earn based on character progression. Additionally, your sleeping habits, diet, exercise and education should have an effect on your character's attributes as well as their appearance. If sleeping was a choice and not forced, how would a lack of sleep affect my education or my wrestling practice? Number 4. AI generated student bullies. Sometimes it's nice to break away from a linear story and just create your own. Imagine the inclusion of randomly generated ranked bullies traversing throughout the school. Each bully has its own set of unique strengths and weaknesses and are protected by other bullies beneath them in rank. However, by defeating a bully, you gain one of their unique strengths, which is the incentive to face them in the first place. The bully you defeat is now replaced in rank by one beneath them who seeks revenge, so the cycle never ends and enforces you to always be watching your back as you focus on the main story. Number 5. Bully 2 Online Some might say GTA Online does a few things ethically wrong, but it gets a lot of things right as well. Let the town of Bullworth be an open lobby, where we can ride solo or join clicks, taking on multiplayer online missions and races. Imagine creating a new starter joining the first year, a younger student who has to learn the ropes and can develop their core skills and even their skeletal body type based on the activities that they take on whilst going through puberty. Wow, you actually watched the whole video. Make your way to the comment section and write See I'm the best man, I did it. I'm going to give you a shout out in my next video. A huge thank you to my Kofi supporters and guardians and everyone who has donated to access my graphic enhancements. Remember to let me know which games you want me to enhance in 2022. Have a great holiday and look out for my next trailer. Peace.